This is Shape You Shredded Club. Today's Monday, and today we're gonna be hitting chest and tries. Let's lift some weights. Today is Chest Mondays. So we're gonna be starting out with incline bench. All right, guys. So if you want to join Club Shredded, you gotta hit chest. Today I'm gonna to show you guys how to build that aesthetic physique. Upper chest is real important to building the chest to make it look more of like a plate body chest. You know, make it look good. We're gonna hit it. Genau. Jeff fängt bei seinem Split immer mit Brust an. Er sagt, es hauptverantwortlich für den ästhetischen Körper. Wir fangen jetzt mit Schrägbank an, einfach um gutes Volumen in unsere Brust zu bekommen, um eine runde Brust zu bekommen. All right, guys, Felix is gonna warm up real quick. He's gonna do 15 reps. He's gonna get the blood flow in the chest and get ready for the chest workout. So as you guys can hear right now, Felix is breathing in as he goes down and then he's doing exhales as he goes up. That's gonna help you uh, hit your sets a little bit more, get you a little bit more powerful than reps. So check out about your grip. I like to do more of an inside grip, a little bit more narrow grip, and that's gonna kind of hit the inside chest a lot more. Also, a suicide grip, so if you roll your thumbs to the inside like that, and grip the bar like this, you're gonna really hit the chest a lot more. Uh, a couple more key points is, you wanna try to like bend the bar in half, get the elbows in real tight. That's gonna help target the chest as well. I know a lot of you guys out there kind of keep your elbows flared out, and when you do that, that hits your shoulders a lot more. In den Griffvariationen kann man dann unterschiedlich die, die Brust treffen. Wenn ihr quasi euren Daumen mit auf die gleiche Seite nehmt wie eure anderen Finger, könnt ihr eure Brust noch besser treffen. Und dann natürlich auch Variationen mit Ellbogen mehr nach außen verlagert. Habt ihr mehr Belastung auf den Schultern. Nehmt natürlich ein bisschen äh, die Power von der Brust weg. Er versucht immer Mix zu finden und äh, auch zu variieren. Alright boys, we're done warming up. Time to hit the first set. Get a little pumped up. Show the boys it's working. You got the gym to yourself, might as well work out straight, let's see what I mean. You gotta see what's hitting it. So the first set, we got the weight up to 185 pounds. We're gonna hit 12 reps right now. We're gonna go nice, slow and controlled reps. Try to bend that bar in half, get the elbows in tight. Let's hit it. Alright guys, moving right on over to our third set. We bumped the weight up 225 pounds, 100 kilos. In between sets, we're doing two to three minute rest periods. So we're gonna hit our third set. We're gonna do eight reps for the third set. Let's get it. Zwischen den Sätzen bleibt ungefähr zwei bis drei Minuten. Wir sollen bei der ersten Übung zu lange Pause machen, bis ihr wieder 100% fit seid. Three, more. Fire on. Perfekt. Wir machen jetzt den Drop Set, sprich er macht sechs Wiederholungen mit dem Gewicht, dann reduzieren wir das Gewicht kurz und dann gleich nochmal so viele Wiederholungen wie möglich. Absolute Failure. Squeeze that chest, baby. All right, guys, so we're heading right to our second exercise, cable crossovers. One thing that I really like to do when I do cable crossovers is I like to cross my arms over, and also I alternate arms. So I'll go one over, come back, get that full range of motion, that big stretch, and then switch arms, and my other opposite arm is gonna go over. So we're gonna do four sets, 12, 10, 8, 8 reps. Each set, drop set, no rest in between drop sets. So, wir machen jetzt den Cable Crossover. Jeff liebt es, seine Arme tatsächlich zu überkreuzen, so wie der Name das schon sagt, weil er dann einfach hier nochmal seine innere Brust speziell treffen kann. 
dann richtig nach hinten uh, stretchen. Wir machen jetzt vier Sätze und in jedem Satz ein Drop Set. I got it. Get that pump. Like set. Good set. Here we go. All right, guys, we got a second set now. Make sure you're coming out right in front of you. I don't want you guys to go down. I want you to go right in front of you. So let's get it. Alright guys, we got a third set right now. Third set, we're gonna be doing eight reps. We're gonna do the same exact drop set. So let's get it. Four. Make sure you're pushing yourself to absolute failure every single set. Yeah. That's how you get the club shredded. Alright guys, we got our last set, fourth set. This is where you make all the gains at. Most important set right now. Let's make some gains. Time to get shredded. Go on. Nice, bro. Alright, guys, so that's it for cable crossovers. We're gonna head on over to flat bench dumbbell press. We're gonna superset the flat dumbbell press with dumbbell flies. We're gonna get shredded. We have jetzt den crossover drop set beendet. We gehen jetzt weiter zur nächsten Übung. We machen jetzt uh, Flachbank drücken mit der Kurzhantel im Supersatz mit Fliegenden. Alright, first set, we're gonna do 10 reps. Get that four inch of motion, go all the way down, big stretch. Last one, we're gonna go down slow. Enjoy it. Alright, we're gonna superset that with flies. What we're gonna do for the flies, we're gonna keep the same angle with our elbows all the way down, right on up, big squeeze. So let's get it, first set, 12 reps. Hier ist wichtig, dass du eine leichte Beugung im Ellenbogen hast, damit das Gelenk schon in dich immer schön den ganzen Bewegungsradius ausnutzen. Alles set da. Ja, hier war ich Alright guys, we're on our second set right now. We're gonna do 8 reps for the dumbbell bench press and then for the flies we're gonna do 10 reps. I'm gonna bump the weight up to 42 kilos for the dumbbell press. I want you to do an inside grip that's gonna hit the inner chest. That's what we're really trying to work on right now. Und sucht euch einen äh, Trainingspartner, der euch richtig pusht. Bestenfalls sucht ihr euch manchmal einen besseren Trainingspartner. Dann kann er noch ein bisschen was zeigen. Alright guys, we got our third set right now. Third set, we're gonna do the same reps as we did for the last set. So let's get it. Make every rep count. Don't cheat yourselves. Wir machen jetzt den dritten Satz. Wir haben das Gewicht jetzt leicht gelassen. Hört auch noch ein bisschen auf euren Körper. Also es zählt nicht das Gewicht, sondern es zählt. Wie viele Wiederholungen ihr schafft und dass ihr es sauber schafft. Yeah. Good. Very good. One more. One more? Okay. Alright guys, we got our fourth and final set right now. We're gonna do six reps for the dumbbell bench press, and then we're gonna do eight reps for the flies. Alright, Felix, everything you got. Last set, let's make it count. Good. You got it. That's 
sound like it, so you're pushing it, baby. We're gonna fail, we're gonna just stop at six. No, when you met, you couldn't only be doing machen, you wanted six months, you shot, but see, you're not Reps are the most important ones. That's where you make all the gains. That's where you tear the most muscle fibers. Turning by squash. Uh, hey. <laughs> Hell yeah. Okay, guys, we're gonna be finishing chest Mondays off with some dips. We're gonna do three sets of dips right to failure. Be leaning forward to help target the chest. That's gonna help isolate the chest. We're gonna go pretty fast in between these last three sets. Also, we machen jetzt als letzte Übung zum Abschluss unseres Push-Trainings noch uh, dips. We machen uh, chest dips, also we lehnen uns ein bisschen nach vorne. Eine Minute Pause zwischen den Sätzen. All right, guys, we're we'll doing our first set of dips right now. I'll show you the good form. Come up, going to failure. All right, boys, we got our second set right now. Blast it out right to failure. If you want to be shredded, you got to push it. Boys, we got our third and final set of dips right now. So let's get it. <sighs> we'll call that good. All right, I love doing dips at the very end of my workout just because dips involve the full chest. You get a full chest workout with it. Helps push yourself to failure. Let's see what you guys got. So that's it for the chest workout. Now we're gonna head on over and do some triceps. The reason why we're doing triceps at the end of the chest workout is due to the fact that when you hit your chest, you're using your triceps. We machen jetzt noch weiter mit Trizeps, und zwar aus dem Grund, weil wir jetzt bei Push natürlich schon Trizeps auch mit trainiert haben. Let's go build some horseshoe triceps, baby. All right, boys, we're gonna move right into the tricep portion of this workout. I like doing scroll crushers on the incline bench because you're able to get a little bit more range of motion on it. We're gonna really focus on keeping the elbows in tight on this exercise. So let's get started. We start with the first exercise. We make French press with a Schrägbank. Einfach wenn man dann noch mal ein bisschen mehr Bewegungsradius hat. It's wichtig, dass ihr die Ellbogen schön eng habt. Wir werden 12 Wiederholungen, 10 Wiederholungen, 8 Wiederholungen machen, wobei wir im letzten Satz einen Drop set. So we're gonna get a nice close grip on this. I'm gonna put my feet up onto the incline. We're gonna get a little bit more range of motion on that. Also, I'm gonna do a suicide grip on this. It's gonna help isolate the triceps to keep them elbows in tight. Genau, jetzt haben wir was zum Griff gerade gesagt. Er macht hier den Suicide Grip, also nimmt den Daumen auf die gleiche Seite wie die anderen Finger, um nochmal mehr den Trizeps zu isolieren. Super. So schön wie er richtig runtergeht, den Trizeps richtig in die Dehnung versetzt. Make sure you're breathing. Don't forget to breathe. All right, one more. Okay. I didn't help you at all. <sighs> all right. Okay, we got our second set of skull crushers right now. About to weight up 10 kilos each side. The reps. Okay, all the way down. Perfect form, keeping the elbows in tight. We're gonna do a suicide grip. Let's go. 
big squeeze at the top. All right, good band. So that's how you do it, guys. Woo! Good set, baby. That's all I like to see. All right, guys, that's it for Skull Crushers. Now we're gonna go finish off some push downs, finish this tricep workout. Genau, wir sind jetzt mit der Trizepsübung fertig. Wir machen jetzt noch eine Trizepsübung. Seid gespannt. All right, guys, workout's finally coming to an end. We're gonna be finishing off this tricep workout with some push downs. We're gonna do three sets of 12, 10, eight reps. We're gonna start in a mid grip, and then we're gonna drop our hands down, and it's gonna be a little bit easier at the bottom of the exercise. We're gonna keep our shoulders rolled back, big chest, and also each set, we're gonna do a drop set, and the drop set's gonna be 10 reps. Also, we're gonna now the last tricep exercise. We're gonna start with the side here in the middle, and when it doesn't work, we're gonna go down, because it's a little bit easier. Wir machen die Übung jetzt nicht so wie gewöhnlich, dass wir mit dem Seil erst runterziehen und dann nach außen, sondern wir starten schon hier oben nach außen zu ziehen, um hier nochmal den äußeren Trizeps richtig zu isolieren. Alright guys, move right on over to the drop set. Make sure you grab mid rope, do a suicide grip. We're gonna spread from the top of the exercise. 10 reps, let's go. Auch hier wieder den suicide grip. Den Daumen auf die gleiche Seite wie die anderen Finger. Und wir fangen schon am Ende an, nach außen zu ziehen. All right, guys, moving right on over to our second set of rope pushdowns. Felix, step on up. So let's get it. Same form as last time. All right, boys, we got our third and final set of rope pushdowns. We're gonna be finishing off with eight reps, and then we're gonna do a drop set, of course, 10 reps. So let's finish off. Party's over. That's it for chest and tries. It's a pretty good workout. Make sure you guys push yourself every single rep. Don't cheat yourselves. We're going right to failure. Perfect workout to get you right in the club shredded. Stay shredded, boys. For information on training, supplementation, and nutrition, visit shapeyou.de.